Since 2016, the Okoreti has shared a friendship with the former First Lady, characterized by the exchange of traditional Damara dresses known as the Horokwes and engagement in cultural activities. However, in the light of the recent death of the President, the group presented the former First Lady with a traditional black Damara dress, a black crepe which is a headgear and a calip which is a shawl. The group explained to the former first lady the cultural importance of wearing black attire during the morning period. This is your dress. The dress is also L shape. We are, it's easy to open the heart. This is, we don't want everyone to see how you cry. So you cry okay in this one. This is also just for the big day to cover the head. The duk is something that was original from our great grand people. It is something that is holding the fontanel. All these items hold significance in the local culture and are traditionally worn during mourning periods. We brought these things for her to dress when she goes to the funeral. Because in our Nukwe culture, of which they also are coming from, it's important that morning time is done in black. So she would put her duk, I explained, to the back and not like this anymore to the front until she finishes with the funeral. And she is a widow now and she would put her dress in such a way that she would moan in black. She will moan in black and after a time it can be removed. That's what we are doing in our Namibian Nukwe culture. This demonstration of cultural solidarity was a moving reminder of the deep-rooted traditions and customs that provide strength and support during times of grief. Richard Lincoln says, NBC News, Casa Rosalia.